Hello there, I'm Ryan McCabe, this is the channel for anything and everything, and today I'm measuring the maximum stretch of surgical tubing. Ow. Now why am I doing this? You know in autumn there's a thing called pumpkin chunking, and it's when people throw pumpkins as far as possible with whatever they have, be it a trebuchet, air cannon, slingshot, whatever. Well in springtime there's a thing called cantaloping, when people throw cantaloupes as far as they can. Why cantaloupes? Just because pumpkins are seasonal. So there's a group of physics students over at Gaysburg College, and we're going to be making a giant slingshot, and we're going to be using surgical tubing. Mostly because of the Mythbusters episode where they were testing a bunch of different types of cords and they showed that surgical tubing proved the best. But we need to know the specifics of the surgical tubing that we have. This is a different size than what the Mythbusters use, so we're going to have to test it. They had a 10 foot length piece of surgical tubing that could stretch over 50 feet. Let's see how much a 5 foot section will stretch. Now I'll be measuring the stretch from this pole here because it's dug into the ground pretty well. I already tied this to it, so let's see how far it goes. Okay, now it's broke. Time to measure. So it stretched about 35 feet, about seven times longer than it was initially. Now I'd say about five and a half times longer is where the safe zone was. By the time it got to six and seven times, it started fraying just where it was getting pulled at. So that's my test for today. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. It hurt a little bit. Not the smartest idea, but I'll be fine. Have a great day and subscribe. Today is the beginning of daylight savings time. And it's daylight saving time, not daylight savings time. Just so you know. And it makes sense, first of all, just because...